The UNA Lions travel to take on a talented Hampton team Saturday in Virginia. Remember DeAndre Francois, the Florida State quarterback who Alabama shut down two years ago, opening weekend of college football? Yeah, well, now he's with Hampton. Lions only had two Kevin points Lomax. in the first half. The it's strong. off this fumble Alabama recovery from the extra return. point. AJ Bracey is going to get the scoop, and he looks back, but ain't no one catching him. He's going to take it to the house, so good momentum early in the game. But like I said, those were the only points scored in the first half. Francois is able to put up 20 on the Lions. This pass looks beautiful on the touchdown, but hey, in the second half, UNA's offense caught up with Hampton. Christian Lopez connects with Jacob Terry, the Lawrence County High School alum, catches his first career touchdown. Everyone is going crazy, but the Lions rally couldn't cap off the win. Final 40-34. Chris Willis says UNA needs to minimize those mistakes. This is part of the transition. This is part of learning. This is part of building a team. And when you got a team of this youthful age and, and, and trying to navigate through it, you're going to have some some uh, tough days. And you know, like I told somebody earlier, we're going to take maybe a step back to take two steps forward sometimes. And this is just part of it. We're going to keep working and grinding, and it's not going to stop. We've got to move on to the next one. And that next one is Charleston Southern at home next Saturday night at 7 p.m. UNA has a bye week this week. So DeAndre Francois, there he is. But I want to switch really quick to baseball. A lot of Braves fans in the area, and they are just getting whoops right now, 13-1. to The Cardinals put up 10 runs in the top of the first inning. That's an MLB postseason record, so yikes. They got a couple more innings to work with, but not looking pretty.